Alrighty, this is my one and only outing for the next couple of weeks. Um, after they closed the resorts, I've decided that I'm going to do the social distance distancing thing that everyone has been doing. I forgot to put earrings on, so I'm going to grab some earrings. I was going to be honest, I wasn't going to go out today. Um, I was going to be like, no, I should stay indoors, blah, blah, blah. But the thing is, is I have to go to work like every day this week anyway. What is one small outing to go grab some Starbucks and a quick lunch? Hmm? So I'm gonna go to Starbucks and maybe get some food depending on what is open. So yeah, I'm gonna take you with me. There are surprisingly a lot, I mean a lot of people here at Disney Springs right now. I guess it's everyone trying to get what they can out of their vacation. Today is Black Friday. There's so many people here. Like, I'm glad that they're closing it down tomorrow because all oh, this Starbucks is closed. <gasps> is the other Starbucks open? Uh, he already has one. Like the other one is open. I did a mobile order for Pete Blaze Pizza. Ace Painting Place is also closed. Makes sense. There's like a ton of people gathered in this. Uh, in the trading pin store and I'm like why are there so many people in here apparently there's a giant Indiana Jones Funko Pop that you can buy I'm like that makes sense also I'd like to point out all of the doors are like propped open so you don't have to open the door where typically that's not the case close the lava lounge Arista crepes is closed not too many businesses are closed though surprisingly I was thinking about taking Jared to Raglan Road for St. Patrick's Day, but probably not a good idea now. This is Pizza Cam. Got my pizza. Surprisingly, indoors and outdoors, they had hand sanitizers for you to use, which was good because they keep their doors closed and I didn't want to open the door. So that was nice. So I'm gonna go to get Starbucks, or at least see if it's maybe open, and then probably head home. Maybe go to Sprinkles, I haven't decided yet. So apparently both Starbucks is at Disney Springs are closed and I'm real upset about it. Okay, here's ultimately why I'm upset that Starbucks is closed. Mostly because they didn't say anywhere that they were gonna be closed. There also wasn't any sign anywhere that they were gonna be closed. And I looked up online and they said that Starbucks stores would remain open, that they would just have a to-go option. So it's not like I didn't do my research. Now I could have tried to mobile order it to see if they were open, because if I tried to mobile order it, it says they're not. So stupid me. But I could have gotten a free drink with my pizza. But I was like, no, I'm gonna get Starbucks. Gang, Puck is also closed. It's interesting which ones are open and which ones aren't. It seems like half of the restaurants are closed and the majority of the shops are open, but there's like a select few that aren't open. I do have to say, after being cooped up in my apartment for the last three days, or two and a half, it's nice to get out. Get out and walk around example of a lot of the messages that you'll see on a lot of the shops right now. Wow, it's nuts. Alrighty, Disney Spring. Good luck to you. I'm going to go home now and not leave my house unless I have to go to work. So I decided to, I filmed this bit earlier, but I decided to re-film it and tag it on to this video. Um, so as of this morning, um, well, first off, every single day, I have been waking up, checking um, our cast member website, checking my schedule for any changes, and then going to um, the, basically Googling the news for Florida to see if there's been any change of cases and so on and so forth. Um, and I've do, done that before bed, first thing when I wake up, and then like sometime during the middle of the day. Um, mostly to see when, the resorts will be closing or to see if there's been any change to um, recreation for my specific job just because the parks are closed doesn't mean that the resorts are closed which means I have to go back into work um, and as of this morning they finally it was funny because I didn't get an email there hasn't been a change in my schedule but as of this morning a friend of mine something else I've been checking is Instagram because I know some people are better at finding information about Disney than I am Friends of mine texted me saying, um, or not texted me, like, com like posted something on Instagram or socials that the resorts would be closing Saturday, no, 
Friday afternoon at 5 p.m. they would be closing which is great because I was supposed to close Friday and Saturday now I don't have to close now so I'm really excited about that um, I'm opening all day I start I'm working Tuesday Wednesday Thursday and those three days I'm opening and then Friday I was supposed to close and now I don't have to I'm gonna be up by five I'm really pumped about it um, Jared unfortunately still has to work um, because he works with public transportation so still until they nix on that he does have to work unfortunately um, but um, anyway I am actually really glad that they're closing their doors, not just because I get a paid vacation, but because um, my job specifically involves like interacting with guests on a regular basis, which typically I'm all for, but in this situation, I don't want to touch anyone. <laughs> um, I mentioned this before in one of my vlogs, we're like currently doing children's activities germophobe mode, like no one touch us, sanitizing everything, blah blah blah. I literally, like I had, I literally bought sanitizing wipes to use in case I had to open doors today um, and I also had a hand sanitizer in my pocket like the entire time it's right here because I do have some left but anyway um so life is definitely changing I'm really quite surprised how many people are at Disney Springs, Springs right now it's probably the guests trying to just get out and like do something else um not that like the resort activities aren't closed but maybe they just want to get out of the resort I don't know um or maybe they're trying to get their last shopping done before their trip ends so any that's why I'm wearing these because I was supposed to go to flower and garden this weekend to get my violet lemonade and that obviously didn't happen so I got to sport these ears I love these ears they're so pretty anywho so yes, the resorts are closing. Um, Jared and I, uh, as of right now, have enough food to get through a couple of weeks. Um, at the end of the month, we may have issues, but we will see. Um, there are ways. I mean, if we have to survive on peanut butter and jelly, like I mean, it's not like we don't have food to get through. It's just we may not. We I may have to get creative. You know what I mean? If it comes to that. Um, I don't know when the resorts are going to be opening again. I don't know when the parks are going to be open again. There's literally been nothing said about us reopening in April. Um, right now it just says we're closed until the end of the month as of right now. But everyone's everything that I've read implies that, that that may change as in we may extend it. So I don't know. Um, who really knows? It all depends on how this quarantine will help. Um, it's gonna be really interesting. I've literally been putting off chores so that way I have something to do. Um, but anywho, don't be scared everyone. Don't freak out. I've said this before. Like there are things to do at home. Um, I know one thing that I said the other vlog um, that I filmed that I'm going to re-say now. Eat healthy. You know when you're shopping, getting all your groceries, remember your fruits and veggies. This may be the opportune time for you to learn how to cook. It's not like you don't have time now. As long as you've got power, internet, water, that you should be set. Um, also, I want to point out that there are two apps for those who want to be active and stay active. There are two apps. Um, Fit On, which is free, and it has all sorts of fitness um, workouts that you can do. And then Tone It Up. You guys know I love Tone It Up. Um, they're doing for this next month a uh, free membership. So you don't have to, whether you have started already and you already used your free membership trial or not, like they're just making their app available to everyone to use. Um, so there's that. Um, you got YouTube, you got Netflix, like there's things to do. You can leave your house. You can go outside. It's a matter of touch. It's a matter of touch, touch, touch. There were so many people at my apartment today that were walking their dogs and going for runs around the apartment. Like you can go outside you're not it's not like in the air it's not a zombie apocalypse guys so anywho again be safe I'm gonna go home eat my pizza maybe make a smoothie because I didn't get my drink I'm so upset I wanted Starbucks I think there's a Starbucks that I can go to on the way home okay so uh I understand now why um the starbucks at disney springs are closed it's because i didn't read the fine print the to-go method that they're going for at starbucks is you you can order online or go through the drive-thru but to pick up your mobile order you have to go through the drive-thru so 
that scared me because I ordered by our local Starbucks. I was like, I really want Starbucks before I go without for who knows how many weeks. Um, and because I had a free one as well. And I was just like, why are they closed? There's signs everywhere. And then like a custodial guy's walking around and goes, yeah, you have to go through the drive through for it. And I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, stay safe and I'll see you in the next one. Whenever, whatever that may be. Come <laughs> by. Thank you.